see the guys have been spray paint yeah. over and stuff already. No, you know, we've, we've never done anything. No, nah, no, you guys are probably alright, but it's just them young yeah. ones, they get up there. Mate, there would have been 18 kids up there last week. <laughs> oh, there, yeah, well, we call the cops and that'll get them. Yeah. Thank, thank you, I'm sorry, thank you. We just got, yeah, so f***ing lucky. By now, I have to save Jeremy because apparently the cops have pulled him over and his license is suspended and his car is in the middle of carrying bar. So I'm about to go move his car for him and then we're heading to one of the coolest places in New South Wales, in our opinion, that's abandoned, obviously. but picking up all the boys and then we're heading there so stay tuned um we did our good deed for the day didn't we picked up some old guy and dropped him to the station <laughs> really fucking old yeah he, he probably would have taken it was about 150 meters and it probably would have taken him an, a good hour to get there so you dropped your phone down the vagina didn't you <laughs> oh, <it's a> <laughs> every time i try to <laughs> wakey wakey hands off snaky kai come on <laughs> Hit my fucking horn. There's a swift in front of us. Stop. Uh, that's why it'll be funny. Come on. <laughs> Just punch him in the head. Abuse. Workplace ah. violence. I'd love to push P in that guy right there. What? No, the fucking cyclist. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I just, I'm staying behind this guy because he's just so attractive. Like, look at that. Oh, the piece of shit got in front of you again. Wait, this 320 D main. I think it would be one of our trips without someone buying Red Bulls and Kai's gonna come out with a four pack in a sec. What did I tell you? More Red Bulls. So as usual, we find ourselves back at the one and only because every time we're down south, we have to visit this place. It's just a mandatory, honestly. All right, so we just fanged the feed. We just um, gobbled down a, some Jeremy takes 10 years to find food and eat it, so we're waiting for him, and he's still eating. <laughs> Jeremy's still eating, you ate like 10 things earlier. You ordered half the fucking menu and you're back. That's a bit rude. So for a little bit of context, we are at a mansion down the south coast of New South Wales, and we've been to this place about five times. I've been with Sam, I've been with Jeremy, I've been with Kai. I just got interrupted by a homosexual. Been with Kai, been with all of these people, but we're back to make an actual video and oh, he just farted in my face. But um, yeah, I'll insert a bit of drone footage here that Kai and I took a long time ago, so it's pretty old. Place has changed a bit since then, but we're heading in. We obviously are not doing any like destruction or anything to the property. We're just checking it out, filming and so everything. We're so we're not going to burn it down. But um, yeah, it should be good. So come along. So the engine is pretty dodgy to this place. Isn't the homeless camp we're going through? No, we're not going to. We're going through someone's yard, kind of. Not really. Yeah. It's kind of on the outskirts. But we're really oh. sorry if the people see this video. We're not trying to, like, invade. You know? Even though, even though they were... Even though... Last time I went here, they were pretty upset at us because they locked up on their dirt bikes. No, that was the other neighbours. What was it? Yeah, the other oh, one's apparently know. toxic. These ones are alright. So... They know what's up. Just don't well, f*** their dog. Yeah, pretty much. Just don't f*** their dog and you'll be fine. <laughs> So this is it, it's pretty damn amazing actually. It's been really damaged since we were last here. Like all this graffiti never used to be there. But as you can see, it's pretty badly damaged now. Was in really good condition, almost like re renovatable, if that's a word. But now it's just destroyed. Every time we come here, it just gets more and more destroyed. You can see. So many, so much tagging. Holy. Yeah, I'll insert a couple photos of a while ago and some footage because this is so demolished. Oh, not demolished, but so damaged since then. You can see this place, if it was actually built, it would have been insanely cool. Like the view has to be the best view in like anywhere around this area, in the Illawarra region area. And they even had an indoor pool, which is now an indoor swamp. Would have liked to see how full this would have been during the floods. This thing would have been- I don't think it went any higher. Overflowing. Right up to where the fucking drains are. Oh yeah, true. 
Yeah, it was. Hello guys, welcome back to Exist Film. <laughs> we explored another haunted abandoned mansion. It's hardly haunted. These rooms, you used to be able to, like, you could probably sit down, it would be all right. But now it's been so demolished. People just come through and trashed it. If you guys find out how to get to this place somehow, yep. don't trash it. No, don't. Don't trash it. It looks sick. So just keep it as it is. People chilling out there. There was no cover here. No, there was an elevator, broken elevator shop. Yeah, it there used is. To be plywood covering it. Really? Yeah. I don't remember that. Well, anyway, no, that's that's the elevator we the shaft. There's no elevator in it. Sam found his session room. <laughs> the pot room. Imagine having this view. The bedrooms are like in there. You just wake up with that view. And that's like your entertaining area. That's kind of sick, eh? Hulk, horny. <laughs> the master bedroom is just through that door over there. But that is the view. Holy. And there's a nice old car just blown up down there. Who watches YouTube shorts, like for real? I don't know. Like that's you go even on worse. YouTube and then you accidentally open a short. Yeah, literally. No, like, like, he's know. actually scrolling through He's scrolling through them, yeah, like TikTok. Far out. Look how, like, you can just, they should just fall. Oh, and it, they drop right down to the basement. This is the back side of this mansion and it's friggin' huge. Obviously it's the same size as the front, but it's sick. But this place actually has like a 12 car garage right under us. You and then you might be asking, Exist Film, why you got a 12 car garage? Yeah. When you only got like six, six cars. cars. <laughs> We're going into the basement now because it's probably gonna be flooded, but it'll be sick. If we do a 24 hour here, we have to sleep in the basement. For 1,000 likes, we'll stay here. <laughs> 1,000 likes. Ooh, it's nice and slippery. Ooh. Yeah, this is where we have to stay. <laughs> this is where we have to stay if we get a thousand likes. If we get 10, what is it? 10,000 views on this video, we'll stay here overnight. Imagine having a rave down here. That'd be sick. Like, this is huge. There's no way people haven't, like, slept down here. Yeah, look. There's some dude up there. So this is, like, some water feature or something. It's pretty sick. I swear it was tiled last time, but there's literally like no reception down here whatsoever. Even though there's like light right there. I mean, I just found your next girlfriend. There's a spider web in front of her. <laughs> I don't, this must be like a sauna and a shower or something. What is that? I got that on video. There's <laughs> like five groups of people here. There was two others when we arrived, now there's like 20. Sam. I found your tag, Sam. Someone's doing math on the wall. <laughs> Someone's doing their algebra homework on the wall. No. Yeah, what's the answer, Kai? That is the answer. Whoa. For You're a genius. Oh, yeah. Used to be an aircon. Used to be an aircon, yeah. This place is weird. Why the f did they install aircon before the <laughs> fucking drywall? Yeah, it's weird. They installed aircon before they installed the house. <laughs> That's pie. Even I know that. So, in here is a 12 car garage. So, the, the motors and everything were here but they've all been stripped and ripped down. And these doors used to be in good condition too. They literally have ruined this place. It used to be really yeah, nice. I mean, it was, yeah. Oh, oh fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. So we're gonna dip now, because I don't think it'll be long before cops will be here, honestly. The neighbors were out and saw how many people were here. So we're gonna dip. Jeremy almost stepped on a pigeon. <laughs> Bye-bye, probably for another few years, depending if this place is even still here. Yo, there's cows! Ooh. They look pretty happy, not gonna lie. You guys probably all right, but it's just the young ones they get up there. Mate, there would have been 18 kids up there last week. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Well, we call the cops and that'll get them. Yeah. Thank, Thank you, I'm sorry. Thank you. So, <laughs> we got super duper lucky. We just got, yeah, so fing lucky. So I swear to God. We spent about 10, 15 minutes walking all the way down a hill. Yeah, and down a big a, driveway. There was a fence. And like there was no way to get past it. It was through a lake, there through mud. Electric, there was an electric fence. Yeah. And then there was a big fence like. Because we went out a different way we went in. And we were just about to turn back to walk the other way. Yeah. And then the owners of like one of the properties next to it opened the gate. They were coming home or something. Yeah. They were really nice as well. I'll insert the clip at the end, but 
Yeah, I got the food. They were super nice. They just said, yeah, it's, look, it's fine, but a lot of people ruin the place. So they just don't want you to go back. They just don't want us to go back, yeah. So it's good. Like, we always suggest to talk to these people as well because they're usually quite friendly as long as you're not a dick to them. Yeah, just which don't, run, we, don't run away. Yeah, don't run away. Don't be spray painting. Don't be vandalizing. Don't all that kind of stuff. If you're like, yeah. the people usually don't care as long as you're not like vandalizing. Yeah. Finally, we had a mission success, eh? It was pretty, pretty intense. It was actually pretty cool. So apparently they're gonna call the cops on like other 20 people. Oh, they were yeah. in there. There were so many people there today. Yeah, it was a busy day. So yeah. <laughs>